Well, hello from Japan. I flew here overnight, so I probably look and sound terrible. But I got here and now I'm trying to figure out the subway station and I wanted to make a video for you guys when you get to Osaka or Japan in general that'll help you out. So when I got to Osaka, the train station here, it's so complex because it's so effective. It's all in Japanese and I don't speak a single word. I went up to the machine, clicked English, and basically you just need to know where you're trying to get to. And from here I just bought a ticket to go to the Osaka subway station. Uh, which is just kind of getting you out of the airport area and then onto the actual grid of trains So that is step one. Well, the reason I probably don't sound very good is because I am super sick uh, So I'm not gonna do too much talking today But I just got to the Namba station and now I am going to the Osaka subway station which you have to walk to I've said it before and I will say it again in the future, but normally being sick does not take me down. This is on another level. I'm like struggling to just make simple decisions. I finally made it though. This video is inadvertently turning into a uh, Apple Maps, Google Maps review showdown for transit that is. And I have to say, this is slightly biased because I do like Apple, but they are killing it in the transit game. Way more information is given to you and they actually tell you how much it's gonna cost, what exit to use when you exit the building. Very, very good, so I was impressed with that, but I'm dying. So, I am gonna go crash for a little bit. Oh man, I don't know if I'm gonna take a nap or not, but I need some time. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Well, the good news is I'm alive. Bad news, I am feeling about a two out of 10, hence the mask. Figured I should be respectful and wear it because I don't wanna get anyone else sick. It sucks, so yeah, I took a little nap, even though I feel like I am headed to the Osaka castle because I only have one day here and I'm not gonna not see it. So, gotta push through anyway. Well, I am so stoked that I am in Japan. Kind of just hit me as I was sitting here taking photos of the Osaka castle behind me. Somewhere that I've wanted to go for a very long time. And uh, it's amazing that I'm able to do it. And it's been a cool day even though I've been sick. It's cool to go see how everyone here lives and how everything works. Try and figure it out for myself and hopefully give you guys some tips. But the one thing that's different <laughs> is that it is much colder here than everywhere else I've been other than the uh, mountains on Java. And so I've got the, uh, the down jacket and my pants on. This is the only two warm articles of clothing that I brought, so you'll probably be seeing them a lot in the next couple days, weeks, whatever it is. Figured it's probably better to not buy clothes and just immediately throw them away when I leave, so. This is the dress code for the next little bit. Now, being sick is just a uh, convenient excuse, but I am so stoked because I'm in Japan and I am gonna go get some good ramen and it is gonna make me feel better and I'm so excited. Let's go there.
Well, ramen is one of my favorite foods, so I am stoked to be in Japan and having authentic ramen. That one was pretty good, but I think we can do better in the next couple days. Uh, I haven't posted a video in a while, and that is going to stay the same for at least tonight because I'm gonna treat my body right and get some sleep and hopefully I feel better in the morning. So I will see you guys tomorrow.